Hello, this is Diana with Artfully Yours, and um, I like to explain a little bit about what, what I do when I'm digitally painting on my iPad. Um, here I'm, I drew in the basic parts of the picture, a color painting in, shading, the rocks, and um, there's a tutorial that I'll link down below that I learned how to um, paint these rocks, not digitally, but the tutorial was an acrylic painting, and that was with painting with Jane, which was a very good tutorial. And she did a painting of a Zen pond with rocks. So I'm doing um, rocks with a lotus flower and cherry blossom branch, and. Um, and, and I'm shading in, yeah, the, um, the lotus flower now, making just the tips of them pink, and then I drag down the color with the blending tool. So by um, dragging down the color in like little lines, oh, there that flashing um, is me changing, testing out different background colors. So there I'm, yeah, just I'm adding pink on the tips, and then I use the blending tool and drag down the color in fine lines to try to to try to depict the veins of the delicate flower. I saw this really good photograph. It was the inspiration for this, and um, oh, it's just so beautiful. And I think it's a photograph. It could be a painting, and. Oh, I, my painting just doesn't even, I couldn't, I couldn't capture it the way that the photograph was, but I, I did the best I could. Right, yeah, I'm still doing that. And then I, I changed the background color to make it an ombre into blue into the yellow green. And then I take, I can remove a layer and bring it back. So there I removed the stone and then, um, then I brought it back again for checking the size. And now I'm removing it so that I can paint all this that's supposed to be in back of the rocks. The weight, um, the wavy, I mean the water and that background shading effect. I can do that all, and if that's what's really cool, I can, show layers and then make them disappear and then make them come back so there now I just made them come back again after I've done the background and the cherry blossom branch and I was trying to figure out all different tools to use to try to make them sim the cherry blossom simple yet effective and yet it, it, it express it how I wanted to um, show it and it's not showing up pink I'm actually using pink and for some reason because of sometimes because of different la layers how they work it, it kept coming up um, lavender Right, so that layer made it, um, I clicked it off. You can turn the layers on and off. So I decided, I, I really went through a lot of indecision with this piece, and I decided I, I want this circular, the circular effect of the water.
so I'm playing with the background. I'm trying to do the background again. And had to get turn off the lotus flower layer. So now I'm just like it's finished, and I'm showing close-ups of it. And, and thank you for watching. Please like, comment, or subscribe, and check out one of my last videos, which was um, flower, or using a real flower in my art journal.